How's it going guys? We are at Lowe's today. We are at the garden center and we're gonna check it out see what we can find. I'm hoping to find some good clearance plants um, but we will see what else we can find. I see some roses that I want to check out first so let's go check these guys out. I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you what they're all looking like. They're really pretty right now. Some really pretty yellow ones. So here's the first one. Really pretty yellow color. Um, who is this? This is Lion King Rose. They are 20 bucks. Coming over this way, some geraniums up front. Looks like some iceberg rose. Ooh, what is this? This is really pretty. This looks like a David Austin colored rose almost. That's really pretty. That, it says it's Lion King Rose, but that one is definitely mislabeled because this looks very like peachy cream in comparison to this. Those are very different roses. Yeah. Here's another pink rose. Yeah. Coming over this way, some hanging baskets of some geraniums. Those are $24.99. Just some red geraniums. Let's go inside now. Oh, I see some cannas. Some bright yellow cannas over here. Let's have that small yellow flower. Very small yellow flower right here. These are $19.98, so 20 bucks. Let's go check out inside. We're gonna head to the back and check out all of the clearance plants. We have a ton of clearance plants here always. Um, I'm seeing racks and racks of clearance. This is the best time of year to go. Let's see what they have. Oh, I'm only actually seeing one rack. So this is the pricing. Less than two is a dollar, two to four, two, so on. So some feather grass, 1098. They look a little rough. Hanging baskets, some petunias, half off of that. Love Rose, $35 half off. See, a lot of this just looks kind of sad. Lots of dead on it. Half off of 17. Let's go this way. I'm gonna start back up at the front now. I checked out the clearance section. Ooh. Some crepe myrtles that have aphids. $18. Crepe myrtles. Very, very sticky. This is a really pretty rose. It is 70 and it's the summer fashion paint. Some lantana, 7.48. Some yellow lantana, also 7.48. Lots of sweet potato vines. They have it in green and in purple. These are big containers for 7.48. Some random zinnias. These look like the California Giant mix. Probably also 7.48. Oh, 6.98. Some 
some geraniums, some of these smaller ones, six bucks. This grass is a fireworks grass. It's actually really, really pretty. This is $13. Really pretty grass. I love that pink color. And they have some of the Evergold Japanese Sedge, 13 some gomfrina. I planted this last year and it did really well. This is the um, pinball purple. I love how this looks. Really pretty color. Some calabrocoa. What is this one? $11. This is Aloha Cajona Cherry Red. Some Vinca. Seven bucks. Very, very bright pink color. Let's go around on the other side. I see some dahlias and a few other things. So, the cutest little tiny dahlia. Um, this is Lisa Dark Pink Dahlia, seven bucks. They're so tiny. Some osteospermum. Really, really pretty sea of color. That's really nice. Those are seven bucks. Some lantana. This is the Lemon Zest. This is $10.98. Very bright yellow color. Some more Lantana. This is Hot Blood Red. $11, $10.98. Geraniums, and I really want to see this guy. Is this Gara? Yeah, Gara. Graceful Pink Gara, $13. I like this. I like these pink blooms that it has on there. A drift of those would be really, really pretty. And some Blue My Mind Morning Glory, I believe. This is the only proven winners that they have. Very true blue color. One of the only true blue colors that I've seen out there for flowers. Look at these caladiums, though. These are really cool. Almost translucent. Those are really cool. With the dark cannas. And then some red caladiums in here also. These ones are very, very shiny. All right, I switched cameras. The other one died. Bee Balm, Minarda, $21. Look at how bright that is. That is so, so bright. Okay. Coming over this way, some big fountain grass. These are pretty. With the Vinca and the Creeping Jenny. What all? Does it say what all is in here? That is the combination that is in there. 25. It's kind of fun. This one's really pretty. Just three different scabolas. So expensive. $30. Oh my gosh. That's really pretty. Over on this side, some begonias. This is Celosia. $3. I think all of these are about three bucks right here. Yeah, $3 for all these little ones. Really, really pretty. That's a, I love how big these leaves are. Some salvia. Hummingbirds go crazy for this one, especially in this bright red color. Really, really pretty. These are also three bucks. And some Dusty Miller. Three dollars. Ooh, that palm tree just fell. Here. This is all the shade stuff. Lots of coleus. I love these ones. I have a couple of these. Some ferns. How much of these guys? 13 bucks. Some hookara. Seven. What is this? This is coral bells. What is this? A princess flower. I have never seen this before. Like soft, velvety looking leaves. And it looks like this one's about to flower. That's a very purple color. Going over this way. Some Pentas, nine bucks. Ooh, some hibiscus. Look how pretty these guys are right now. 
really bright red color. That's crazy. Cannas. These ones are really pretty. What variety is this? Blanket flower. Gallardia. Hmm. Look at that. That is so pretty. And even when they're done blooming, these are really soft. That's really, really pretty. This is the Hollip Salvia. I love this stuff. The hummingbirds go crazy for it. Um, Autumn Sage. If you want something that hummingbirds are going to go crazy for, look for this. The smell is incredible. And they love these little flowers. They have so much Vinca. Purple Fountain Grass. 648. I do need a couple of those, though. Okay, if we come down this way, this is where all the boxwoods are. And you guys, I need about... 750 of these. Winter gem is the one that I want. They're $10.98 a piece. And this is about the size that I need. What is this guy though? This is Golden Dream Boxwood, $12. But it's variegated, so that's kind of cool. And then over here, this is Japanese Boxwood. What size does this get? three to six feet tall and wide. And that's gonna be too big. And that is $11 also. So they have a whole bunch of these guys. And then more winter gems. Coming down this way, a bunch of trees. I think this is a locust tree. I would love a locust tree. Let's see. Oh, pistache, 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 100 bucks. So much more expensive than my other place that I like to go to. Here's an olive tree. Look, it's bearing olives. Some topiary, three bald topiary right here. It's kind of fun. Those are one, 170. Come on around this side. Over here, I'm gonna go to my favorite section. This is the Monrovia section over this way. Usually it goes all the way up to here, but this is all citrus right now. So this is like $33 for a orange fruit. Some of them are even bearing fruit. But this is the Monrovia section and they always have the nicest, nicest trees. Oh my gosh, a cherry tree, do you guys see that tag? 250, the bark on it's really, really pretty color. I don't know if it's picking up on the camera, it's really bright out here. Um, and I love these two, these ice blue yellow woods. Brent doesn't like them, 250. 25 feet by 25 feet, cone shaped. Really pretty. I love the blue, and they have so much blue here. Here is a juniper. It's very, very woolly, but it's supposed to be in topiary form right now. So they must have had it for a while. 180. Some more smaller ones, some junipers, 180, those the spirals, and then a smaller one. This one's one of six for the mint juniper. You can see the size for the one of six and the, what did I say? 180. So, eh, it's got like a foot on it, maybe. There's a really big one back here. Oh my gosh, this one's really tall. How much are you? Oh, 180. Wow, you are much taller than this one. Um, we got 108, some really pretty, what is this? Oh, the tag is missing off of it, 80. Tag is totally missing off of it. And $13 for a uh, Fujia Jane Gold. So Arvita, some blueberries, which I just found out that there's a blueberry farm really close to me. So I wanna go see if I can check that out, 40 bucks. Nope, this one has berries coming. Let's go to the other side. Over here. Some hawthorns, 14. Little one gallons. This is mountain pepper. I have never heard of this, but the stems are really, really red on this. 12 feet by eight feet. Zone seven through 10. Hmm. Some tower boxwoods, 54. Good size ones. These get nine feet by two feet. 
so perfect to just tuck into places. These are some taller ones. Oh, this is a holly. Oh gosh, that's perfect. Look at the holly leaves in comparison to the box of leaves. Basically the same. And the hollies are so much faster growing and so much cheaper. 60 bucks and um, 12 feet by 80 feet. You can see, size difference, a whole foot on it. And like I said, 54, 59. It's kind of a weird guy. Cranberry cotton Easter, cotton nester, cotton nester, 139. And you train it to whatever size. <laughs> but little berries on it. Winter gem box. This is a very big fluffy guy. All right. That's weird. See so you know this Skylark, twelve bucks, five feet and wide, tall and wide. Hmm. Weird. They look like little pieces of pepper. Star Tree Ivy, 44.98. Six feet by five feet. These are huge. Oh. Five foot by six foot, 64 Chase Tree. Alright guys, well I didn't get anything. We are headed home and I specifically didn't buy anything because we are going to go to the coast in the next couple of days and we're going to go to a couple of nurseries out there and so I didn't want to buy anything today uh, because it's local and I'll be able to find it again. So um, we're going to head to the coast and that's going to be a really fun trip. One of my favorite nurseries in the entire world is out there. And I'm hoping that it's not too late in the season, which I think it's like 60 degrees there. So it shouldn't be too hot there at all. Um, but there's two places there. I love them. And they're, this is one of my favorite places in the world. So we're going to head out that way and that'll be tomorrow's video. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.